Some people don't find out until it's almost too late. Sometimes we meet people first in the emergency room once they have a heart attack. Most times the warning signs were there, but many times they went unnoticed. In addition to cholesterol, blood pressure, EKG and stress tests, there are three additional heart tests you should know about. The first, calcium score. Done with a simple CT scan, it shows the amount of calcium buildup in the arteries. When you see the calcium in the artery, it's a marker that you already have disease in your arteries. The more calcium, roughly speaking, more disease. Second is advanced lipid testing, which measures the concentration of bad cholesterol in your blood. High levels can boost your heart attack risk by 15 percent. So not all the cholesterols are the same, so besides the basic lipid profile, which is total cholesterol, LDL cholesterol, which is bad cholesterol, HDL, and triglycerides, we uh, frequently use uh, um, subsets of uh, lipid profile going into the subtypes of the um, molecules. A third test, the carotid intimal medial thickness test. It's a 15-minute ultrasound that allows doctors to detect thickening in the neck arteries that lead to the brain. When someone wants to find out what are the risk uh, of things happening 5, 10, 20 years uh, down the road, we, we uh, on occasion use that test to find out the very beginning of disease. These tests don't predict a heart attack but should provide risk factors and could be a warning sign to take care of your heart health. For Lee Memorial Health System, I'm Amy Osher.